fact, we know that X-Ray Girl has played the game. And uh, she, I, she wore a blue wig for it, too. So let's talk about Dustborn. So um, this is a Kotaku article. We're not going to read the article, but this is the headline right over here. It says, Dustborn developers condemn tidal wave of hate and abuse directed at team. A choice-based adventure has been the latest game targeted by can uh, sorry culture war nonsense. Uh, I... I've seen clips, but uh, you know, Gray, Mark, like, ha, 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 like, what have you seen of this game that's that, that makes it even worse? Like, I, I, I've I've seen enough of it to be highly suspicious that it's like secretly a Daily Wire production and it's all just a parody. <laughs> like, honestly, it's it's a joke. It's it's really over the top. Oh yeah. man. Did uh, X Ray Girl get a respawn, refund, or she's still playing it? No, like, she did. Well, both. She got a refund, but then uh, people were asking her to play it so much that she was like, "It would be financially irresponsible of me to not rebuy it and play more of it." But uh, <laughs> I'll be uh, right back. Though I'm just gonna grab a bottle of water. I've lost mine, and my voice is going. All right. Oh, uh, uh, no worries. Uh, so, Gray, um, let's say if someone gifts it to you, here's thirty bucks. Mm. Can you play Dustborn and stream it? <laughs> Uh, I I don't really have a choice if that happens, but I don't think it's happening. <laughs> but yeah, it's a shitty game. It's like, especially if you uh, this week we cover like people were covering the funding. It's not just Norway that funded this. Like it took U.S. also funded it and other parts of yeah Europe. Yeah, it's like it, it it got millions apparently millions of pounds, millions of euros in funding, and this yeah. is what they came up with. It's like, oh god, man. It's like, and I thought, like, apart from the your racist clip, it's like other clips were beginning to emerge. Like, oh, you can bully, you can cancel. It's like, it just, it, yeah, see what I mean? A, like, it's a full bully and it's cancel a, are powers in this game. Everybody. Yeah, it's not, he's not just saying those words. Yeah, it, it's a full on lens on the brain of these people and how they think and how they interact with other people. It's like, it's the DEI, the video game personified. Yeah, like I've seen uh, some gameplays of this, and this is really bad. So I don't think do they actually show the actual? No, they do. They do not. So I think I, I actually have the thing pulled up. Uh, it's it's uh, let's see if I can find it. Um, the, the Dustborn thing, it is uh, right over here. See, uh, we expected Dustborn to spark a conversation and debate, and looked forward to engaging with our players in a positive and constructive fashion. Unfortunately, that conversation has been drowned out by a tidal wave of hate and abuse. We welcome thoughtful feedback and respectful criticism. We embrace discussion and debate, but we have zero tolerance for hate speech, harassment, and threats of any kind. Those who engage in such behavior will be removed from our community. I, wait, I, well, what about inclusivity? <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Uh. But yeah, it's uh, I I I can't believe that this is actually legitimately a game. But uh, yeah, but uh, the thing is, um, they they actually talking. I I believe I'm trying to look for the the actual thing. But uh, while I'm looking for that, it's do you think that this game actually, you know, warrants people to get triggered? Like it, it the thing is that people are playing it. Is it actually that bad? Well, I mean, it's it it's that obvious like it's that in your face as far as like does it trigger me it's, no i mean like i'm not like i'm not like infuriated by like oh my god they have a they have a powerful black woman who's the front woman of a band who who has special powers that can trigger people that offends me it's like no like that that, that doesn't bother me at all it's just mm -hmm. silly it's cringe it's like i can't believe people got paid to make this thing and released it and i mean it's obviously also not just me because, I mean, my wife has more viewers than this game has active players when she plays this game. <laughs> like, it's like, you guys aren't buying it either, okay? <laughs> so I think everyone can agree that this game is silly and sucks. But yeah, what's more wild is I can't believe that... I can't believe it's serious. Like, I think actually, I um, mirror Tony G says, like, the Tom Hardy, that's bait meme. Yeah. It's like, that's what this game is. Like, this feels like, like bait. It feels like rage bait more than an actual thing. Yeah, so right over here. Okay, so, so I actually found it right over here. So the first paragraph says, since we first announced Dustborn, we've read your comments and listened to your feedback, hopes, and wishes for the game. Over the past four years, our team has poured our, uh, sorry, their hearts 
into telling a story that's deeply meaningful to us, a story about the power of words, about building a world where everyone can feel safe, about love, relationships, and robots, of course. So uh, if that's the case, then uh, I do want to bring up a clip over here. They're talking about how um, you, know, you want to be uh, safe about love, friendships, and robots. Uh, there's a clip right over here. Comes source from learning the law. And it talks, uh, there's a robot over here. Let's see what they do to this robot. Let's see. Oh, hello. Hey, what's the golem doing on the bus? Ma'am, I'll be happy to serve as your driver. Oh, why is she so mad at the robot? I want Wait, to assure you that I'm fully capable of the only option to address this robot after he's, after it says I'm, I'm capable of operating this vehicle is to push this robot. Oh, what what does push mean in this context? Is that like to? I think literally, literally, physically push this robot. I think. Oh, uh, well, no, but isn't it isn't it all like dialogue choices here? I think like push might be like start to berate him or something. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. I don't mean that you have software. Of course, you lack the paperwork, but I don't need any. I'm not going to be mean to it. I don't know if there's a way through though. Yeah, I think push is just. Don't people. touch me. Hey. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Push basically. Why is she so mad? Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. Like that, that's what I mean. It's like it can't be serious. It's like, <laughs> oh man, that's oh no, dude. Like this ro I bet you the reason why this robot is like they're so mad at this robot is because the robot's taking the bus driving job away. They're taking their jobs. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. So he's like AI, I guess. Yeah. Like that, or the robot doesn't have any pronouns. Not like yeah, I mean, So, but like, uh, that gives me so many questions about like, how do robots work in this world then? Like, do they have feelings? How developed is their AI? Should we feel bad for that robot? Is you shouting, don't touch me, and like reacting aggressively, something that it's even going to give a shit about at all? Or might it just be like, this human's heart rate is elevated? Yeah. And another thing over here, I'm just going back to this uh, this first paragraph. It's all about a world where everyone feels safe. And then this is one of your power-ups. It's called Bully. We've learned this one uh, to saying. bully people. Bully gives us the power to force people to do something they may not want to do or to make them feel bad about themselves. In fights, this could be highly effective on targeted enemies. Oh, man. Yeah, this is, yeah, like you said, Mark, this seems like satire. No, like, no honestly, if it ends, like if, if the post credit scene in this is Ben Shapiro just going like, thank you for playing this. Do you understand that this is what the <laughs> Wilburos are trying to teach you? They're trying to teach not you, but your kids as well. My wife's a doctor. Oh, man. And so, so here's the thing. There's a person that's extremely unhinged about people who are talking about this game. And uh, this person, okay, don't go harass this person. Um, I don't know who this person is. So it says, uh, men as con as a concept was cooked. Men are the weakest link, truly. What does men as a concept was cooked even mean? I guess men being a um, you know, a figure. I, I don't know, being a. What well, uh, was cooked? It, wait, is this a? I guess it is a reply. What's the what's the reply to? I I I don't know. This is just something I found. Oh. Okay. And he here's another one. You see. Uh. Wow. Do not read the comments on the Goodbye Volcano High trailer on YouTube, man. Sometime in the future, gamers might realize that everything isn't made to cater specifically to you, and that's okay. Personally, can't wait to fulfill my dream of being a gay dinosaur. I still remember when the first trailer for that game came out. It was so funny. <laughs> like, yeah. I, mean, like... I, believe, I believe this is the developer of the game. Oh, I know okay. Was... Goodbye Volcano High? Or no, 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 of Dust, Dustborn. Like, oh, okay. I know she was the one who responded when the allegations came out that the dorm rooms of Dustborn is a copy paste of GTA. I know she was the one who responded. Oh, I see. And here's another one. It's like, I will, I will put knitting men and sexy non binary peeps in your video game, and I will never stop. Be afraid. I come not in peace. Well, I mean, this is this is just a, a not very nice person. Let's, yeah, let's, like this. This isn't someone who wants to make good video games. This is someone who wants to piss people off. She yep. wants to piss off the people she doesn't like. And here we go. This is if you go to her 
Well, you can't really harass her anyways. I'm not saying you should, but no, uh, you don't. She's you're talking. Yeah, don't. It's you're talking to a wall anyways. Like yeah, you're not going to convince this person of anything because her account is private and protected. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, even still, <laughs> there, there we go. Anyways, G- like game designer, could, you should <laughs> yeah, game buy designer Dustborn. Redford. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I think uh, this game is uh, looks really, really bad. And let's go ahead and check the Steam charts while we're at. I think I think it's definitely really fun checking that out. It's, it's, it's because still like 83, I imagine. Dustborn. All right, Dustborn current. <laughs> <laughs> still at 83. Yeah. Uh, 23 right now, highest well, in past 24 83 hours. is the, the peak, though, right? Yeah. Is that, isn't that the all-time? Yeah, that's the yeah. all time. So, I mean, it, the the far right number is the only one that we really need to look at cuz that that yeah. one will stay up forever. So like there's mm-hmm. never been more than 83 people playing this game at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. yeah and, I, and like I, said, I told Phil, yeah, yeah, we have more viewers right now than their all time peak. <laughs> it is something. Yeah, and Mark like you said uh X-ray girl got like like it, last no, like, I saw something, it I, I'm, no joke like 10 times the amount of players the game had were watching x-ray girl and x-ray girl is not like a gigantic streamer either she's not like you know she's not we're not one of the people that has like just forty five thousand people watching her casually you know yeah man that that's really really bad oh uh, and 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 if if the fact that we hate it it's a it's a problem for them uh but you know uh waste of money who cares you, like people are like, oh, you gotta play this game. You gotta give this game a shot. It's the same thing with this. Same thing with Concord. Same thing with any garbage game that they're coming out with. People are just not gonna play it. But uh, like I said, uh, do not gift us this game. We will not play it. Please don't. <laughs> maybe Gray will. Maybe, maybe Gray will do it. Um, I, I okay. will not. I'll I'll, I'll, I'll reject the gift. You can also do that on Steam, everybody. <laughs> So, oh, I didn't know you can reject stuff. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you, really? you can oh. just say it's cool, man. Don't worry. And like hit the, the you don't have to hit accept. Thanks for checking out this segment of the Project Egg Row podcast. If you like what we do here, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you will know next time when we go live. We do go live every Saturday at 8 p.m. Once again, we are just getting started. Tons of more video to come. Thanks, and we'll see you guys next time.